But really, how I even know what a vibe is, man, when I don't even, we don't really know each other. Look, this is going to be me, regardless of the fact. But personally, y'all know my temperament. You know what I'm saying? Y'all don't know what I allow in my space. So the little shit that happened last night, that shit was whack. So I need to I need to separate myself from certain things and let people understand, like, I'm here for entertainment. I'm here for motivation. I'm here for, you know, education, whatever it may be. And I'm cool, but if you don't know somebody like that, you shouldn't talk to somebody like that neither. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Midwest Kong. Today is chest day, so we do. I'm gonna just show, like, a lot of people ask me about the difference between barbell, dumbbells, uh, and machines. So today, I'm gonna give a routine on me. <laughs> on me. Uh, you know, hook you up. I'm gonna give a routine that is a, pro a good mass builder and good muscle conditioning. So we're gonna use the hammer shirt today. Make sure you go to hyphalab.com, promo code Kong. See if I get this away, do it. You gotta do me for it. You scratch my back, I'll scratch yours. You definitely just scratch my shit. Cause... So we're gonna do some volume training on this incline machine. So that's all we're showing today. And uh, look, man, hit subscribe to the channel, man. Do me a favor, man. Hit subscribe to the channel. I need you to subscribe to the channel. I'm not gonna ask your ass again. Is, man, we doing incline, man. Any exercise really is to target the muscle, man. Make sure you hit exactly with the upper chest. You can do work in a lot of front delts, not really hitting your uh, upper pillows. So, move the seat, hand placement. It takes a long time to develop this shit, man. I still see a lot of y'all, you know what I'm saying, with flat upper chest, like myself at one time. And um, that's why your v necks fit like that, you know? Your v necks look like trash. You have no male cleavage. Um, that's about the only cleavage you want is the male one. And you want it to start with the upper chest all the way down. Y'all look like, uh, you know, Medea. Y'all got Medea boobs. You know what I'm saying? Hang out onto your waistline. So, we'll get your upper chest right. So, make sure you do the hand placement. Get your seat right. And then target the muscle, man. Quit always trying to tell everybody what you're going to do and how you look and what types of lifts you do. You don't look like you do nothing. You should be listening, man. That's what I have to do. Due to the fact that we have a smaller gym, we only got 1045s. So now we're going to 35 and to 10. Let me tell you something. I'm very anal when it comes to weights. As far as like uh, if we in the gym and they got steel weights and they got rubber, I have to match. If it's too back, gotta be too silver. Like I'm like that. So I can't stand when I'm pyramiding to do like a 35 and a 10. I don't know what it is, I don't know. It's just me, I've been lifting since I was 16 years old. I don't know, it's just me, but no, nonetheless, man, you see how we're doing the pyramid, we're doing a lot of sets, and we did a warm up too, so it's a lot of sets, and we're going heavy still. So you can really do both, man. It's about what you train your body to do. So we put pulling up on probably, I don't know, y'all gonna have to count the reps at the end, because I ain't really even counting. I'm just doing what I feel good doing. But uh, so now we're going up. This is 
335 or 45, 35 in the 10. So we're getting, getting up to that little upper weight, man. Get them upper pillows right now. You want shoulders to cry on. And you want pillows for your chick to lay on. When my ebook come out, that's not gonna be for free. Some of y'all ain't gonna have no girl to swim Because you watching other people YouTubes. And not this one. Shoulders to cry on. Pillows to Netflix and chill. I can't give it to you better than this. clear some up too y'all know I'm very very personable on YouTube like I try to comment back try to talk to people try to show people I sh truly appreciate the love y'all give you know what I'm saying some people got a little bit out of pocket a couple times but it wasn't nothing major you know what I'm saying I'm chilling you know what I'm saying? I, don't, I don't care nothing about none of that sucker shit so I do want to explain something though I had a weird exchange last night let me just tell y'all something man this is only you only seeing what I'm giving you like, real talk, there's no other YouTuber, and I'm new, so this is who I am. So if it's two million views or whatever I got now, two million followers, subscribes, whatever, this is who I am now. That's who I would be then. It's YouTubers that y'all support that won't even hit like on your comment. So let me tell you something, man, and I was told to be careful with this. I was told by successful YouTubers that I should watch how personable I am because then people feel like they know you and they feel like they can talk to you any kind of way. So let me just be clear. I'm cool until I'm not. That's as simple as that. So I'm gonna cut down how I communicate with people and no disrespect to nobody because that person know who I'm talking to. I'm gonna cut down how I communicate with people because real talk, I, I don't have to do that. If you like my content, you're gonna like it regardless. Y'all like everybody else shit that don't even acknowledge y'all. So, I've been, I feel disrespected. I feel like it was weird. So, at the end of the day, I'm gonna have to cut that out. If I say something to somebody, y'all know that's true. You know what I'm saying? I, I, feel, I feel your vibe. Well, I even know what the vibe is, man, when I don't even, I don't, we don't really know each other. Look, this is gonna be me, regardless of the fact. But, personally, y'all know my temperament. You know what I'm saying? Y'all don't know what I allow in my space. So the little shit that happened last night, that shit was whack. So I need to, I need to separate myself from certain things and let people understand, like, I'm here for entertainment, I'm here for motivation, I'm here for, you know, education, whatever it may be. And I'm cool, but if you don't know somebody like that, you shouldn't talk to somebody like that neither. So it, was, it shit was weird, and all I'm saying is don't, don't feel disrespected if I'm not so quick to be at the disposal, and I shouldn't be anyway, because I do have a life. So. Regardless of the fact, man, we eliminate sucker shit. All I'm saying is, man, look, I'm cool until I'm not. So for people to, you know, then I was called vain and shit. Like, man, hey, hey man. Like I said, y'all know me West Kong. Y'all don't know the motherfucker that I was born at 1243, 1980, June 14th. So fall back, man, because it, it, it's a whole different story when I'm in that space, though. So I said, man, like I said, a lot of reps, we did a, a real, real, real good warm up though, before we start pounding that weight on. So we went 25 pounds up. Then we jumped 20 pounds after that, you know what I'm saying? So a lot of, like I said, I don't even remember. I just remember just rapping. I don't even know how many sets it was, but it was a lot of volume and it was heavy weight. So you can do both, man. You know what I'm saying? Like don't don't get stuck on the whole, I only have to do it this way. You know what I'm saying? I, I was like that for years. That's why I sucked. You know what I'm saying? That's why I wasn't getting gains because muscle confusion wasn't there. So doing shit like this, you're confusing the muscle. And as for what I address, I'm standing on that, man. Look, I, listen. I need to understand something. I'm not just a dude making YouTube videos. Like I said before, I'm not a YouTuber dude. I'm a, a guy in this space, a martial artist, a fitness dude that put you, when, when I say that, that means I'm not about to be dealing with bullshit. A lot of YouTubers, they keep it moving. I ain't know that. I, I gotta get you, I gotta adjust you and get it going. So again, we good. 
we good till we not. You know what I'm saying? Can't nobody, no place, no time talk to me any kind of way. That just don't happen. If you don't hit that subscribe button, what I'm gonna do? Y'all know what I'm gonna do. We need calm. The world needs him.